Hello, in this video I'd like to talk about a warning that often comes up in the Google Search Console. And this is the duplicate without user selected canonical. If you haven't heard about this before, it can be quite scary at first. So before we start talking about this warning message, we need to first understand what a canonical URL is. A canonical URL is the preferred version of a page, a URL, that the search engines should use as the primary URL for that page. So basically, this is the URL that you, as a website owner, want search engines to index. And when this is not clear for the search engines, this is when you get this warning message. So in very simple terms, the duplicate without user selected canonical means that Google has found multiple versions of the same content on your website, but it's not clear which one you consider to be the preferred version. This can happen for various reasons, but most often it happens if you have multiple URLs with similar content, but you haven't specified a canonical URL for each page. If this happens, you will see this error warning or message here in the search console. Now, this is a problem because if you don't specify your preferred version, Google may decide for you and it may not be the page that you want indexed. Uh, this is also a problem because when Google or other search engines encounters duplicate content, it can affect your website's search engine rankings as it may not be able to determine which version of the content is the most relevant and valuable to users. To resolve this issue, you should select a canonical URL for each page and ensure that all duplicate versions of the content point to that URL. This helps Google understand which version of the content to index and display in search results, and it can also improve your website's search engine rankings. So what can trigger this warning? So I already mentioned duplicate content. It may also happen if um, your web host doesn't force HTTPS on your website. So for example, the same page is available via HTTP and HTTPS. Obviously that is going to trigger this uh, problem. So if that's the case, then you have to make sure that HTTP is always redirected to HTTPS. In most modern web hosting companies, it's basically automatic, but if you have more control over your server, for example, if you have a virtual private server or a dedicated server, you have to make sure that this doesn't happen. It can also happen if you have very similar or identical content on, uh, on uh, multiple pages. In that case, you have to tell Google which page is the canonical. And also it can happen when uh, you have uh, pagination, for example, you have to make sure that the websites you are using has a, 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 a correct pagination structure. If you are using uh, WordPress, you probably have no problem with this, but for example, if you have a custom built website, you have to make sure that pagination is built in, a, in an SEO friendly and uh, correct way. Uh, it can also happen if uh, your content is being scraped or copied by other websites, it can create duplicate versions of the same content across the web. So make sure that you add the canonical tag to your page. So how can you fix this? Well, if you are using WordPress, then you are probably using one of the most common uh, SEO plugins. And usually these plugins have an option for this. So let's go over to one of my uh, website. So I'm here on my WordPress website. And uh, let's just create some test post. It doesn't really matter. We could create a test page. Let's name this test post. Let's add some dummy content here and click publish. Let's view the post. And if I view the page source, you can see that the plugin 
automatically added the canonical URL, the, cani the canonical link tag to the post. Now, if this post is not your preferred content, so if you want, so if you have a different post that, uh, that's more relevant, then what you can do is to, you can go back to the post and just scroll down to the uh, rank math settings, go to the advanced tab and just here paste the URL of the, of the main page of the preferred version of this content. So for example, let's, um, let's type something. Okay, let's update the post. And if I refresh it, this URL should change. And yes, it changed. So now when Google comes to this post, it will know that it doesn't have to index this because there is a, a better version or more relevant version of this content. And it will go to this URL and it will index that page. So if you do this, you should be able to avoid this uh, duplicate without user selected canonical uh, warning. Now, if you have a custom website where you don't have uh, this kind of uh, uh, SEO plugin, then you need to place this link tag into the head section of your page and make sure that you have this rel attribute with the canonical value in it. And of course, you need to add the link or the URL of your preferred version of that page. So basically, this is how you can fix this uh, warning in, in the search console. And if you see this uh, warning, make sure that you quickly address this and uh, you fix those pages because this affects your search engine rankings. And obviously this is not good for your website. If you have any questions, leave a comment below the video. Don't forget to subscribe the channel and hit the like button. And thanks for watching.